Find out which state is looking to repurpose federal stimulus funds. How one group of Americans are finally seeing over $10,000 in disaster relief stimulus checks and the breaking news from President Biden yesterday and his two month extension to the stimulus eviction moratorium had a cost of basically, you know, hugging Chuck Schumer, which was kind of an interesting uh, visual picture. So stay tuned. Hey, everybody, it's Andrew Cartwright. Happy hump day. It's Wednesday. I hope you guys are doing fabulous. Here's your daily stimulus check, second stimulus check, third stimulus check, fourth stimulus check, executive action, executive order, and stimulus package update for Wednesday, August 4th, 2021. Thank you, Stephen, so much for reaching out and buying my real estate program. And uh, you, I, <laughs> I credited you. Thanks again for the purchase. Uh, my goal is to give you the best information so you can access government money and for yourself, your business, and your loved ones. In the description, you'll see loans, the 12 different programs, 75 different banks, interest rates as low as 3%, SBA, 504, all kinds of stuff. Make sure you check it out. Stay tuned to the channel here for personal finance, real estate, stock market, credit, crypto, and investments to help generate your income as well as save you loads of money. Right now, I'm giving away $2,000. All you got to do, subscribe, like, comment. We're going to pick a random comment and we hit 200,000 subscribers and we're launching $2,000 to just a random comment that's picked. So make sure you put it in there, like for the YouTube algorithm because boy, it helps out so much when you like the video, they push it out to more people and you're doing your part and you might burn a couple calories, just smash that like button. Also grab two stocks with Weeble valued up to 2,300 bucks. A lot of people have done that. So if you haven't done that yet, make sure you do it. The stocks could be worth over $2,300. So don't miss out on that. It's amazing. There's no catch. Also my real estate program, $45 million in mistakes I paid for that you don't have to. For $99, you can get a $10,000 worth of information, real estate course, 36 videos, resource list, all kinds of stuff, when to buy, how to buy, what asset classes, all the different asset classes broken down, how to get the cheapest money and how to not even use your own credit. You hit the link, I automatically discount it, so it's discounted to 99 bucks, I put the code in there. You pay with PayPal, so you're safe. Also, my Patreons, you guys rock. So many of you guys have like $3 and you support the channel, five articles a week, and a look under the hood of my investments. Thank you guys so much, I appreciate you. But first, the great state of New Mexico is looking to repurpose $20 billion in federal stimulus funds to help boost renewable energy efforts and increase jobs in the land of enchantment. Now, many states across the entire country have this same money, so I, can only, you know, co I can't cover all 50 in one video. So make sure you check with your state. A lot of them are asking for your input. According to the recent study from the Advanced Energy Economy, quote, renewable energy sector could bring a multi-billion dollar boost to New Mexico's economy along with thousands of jobs. They also stated federal stimulus investment of $20 billion in renewables could add 117 billion to New Mexico's domestic gross product, their production, gross domestic production. This is amazing. How do you get a multiplier like that? You put 20 in, you get almost five times back or six, right? Almost 120 billion out of doing that. Mark Adelson, executive director of New Mexico Wildlife Alliance states, a federal investment in cleaner forms of energy will be good for the health of the lands, wildlife, and water, and will diversify an economy that has become overwhelmingly dependent on oil and gas. This sounds like a great use of federal funds, uh, relief stimulus funds. I think it's about time, folks, that we pivot into like where we are now. Technology is caught up. We can use renewables. Hopefully, this investment in renewable energy and jobs can make a significant impact on the economic through New Mexico and throughout the country. So make sure you check. Hopefully we'll pivot to renewables. Right now, a lot of the big funds are only paying out 5% and it's hard to compete with stuff that pays 15% returns. So they definitely need government money. Meanwhile, we've talked about on this channel before that students across America are receiving disaster relief stimulus checks for over $10,000 to assist in their student loan payments. Colleges across America are using stimulus funds 
to wipe out unpaid fees, low-income students with recent reports from Fortune, which is where we got this, outlining a case where a student from Trinity University received a stimulus check for $11,000 to cover student loan debt. Just check out of the blue. Hopefully, that you, can, you just direct it, deposit it right in there. According to the Department of Education, there are rules around how schools can use their stimulus funds, but the government, quote, strongly encourages schools to help alleviate money students owe directly to the, sc to the schools. Excuse me. While President Biden has yet to offer full student loan forgiveness, even with the pressure from Democrats in the House and Senate, the American Rescue Plan stimulus bill, ask colleges and universities to use part of their $152 billion in disaster relief funds to erase unpaid fees for students across America. You know, they're getting paid up front this money. It sure would be nice if they, you know, discounted their uh, as well. If just a kind of a suggestion for colleges, why don't you discount some of this stuff? This is great news, though. We got to, you know, call it for what it is. Millions of students that are swimming in student debt. Well, be sure to speak out. If you're in college or university, we, I know we have lots of people in colleges and universities, as well as high school, as well as seniors. I mean, we've got everybody here. You guys are awesome. I love my audience. To see the, them offer disaster relief checks to cover secondary schools is amazing, and the expenses. And we got to cover this. This is amazing. This happened yesterday. Finally, President Biden and the CDC announced yesterday a new ban on evictions that many renters helping the millions of Americans, 11 million, in need of rental relief and relief in regards to stimulus checks, mortgage forgiveness, and extra time Americans need to kick off, to be kicked out of their homes, which we don't want to see. We want to see them get the rental assistance, stay there and fix the problem. This is no time to put your head in the sand. This gives you some more time to go after that rental assistance, which is a nightmare right now. The new two-month moratorium expires October 3rd now, while officials at the CDC created the new eviction moratorium aimed at protecting tenants in counties with, quote, substantial high levels of community trans transmission, end quote, affecting roughly 90% of the United States population. So if you're in the 90%, you're probably good. President Biden explained, this is what he said, there can be no excuse for any state or locally not accelerating um, funds to landlords and tenants that have been hurt during the pandemic. We're trying to, they're trying to get this money out and boy, has it been frustrating. People are putting their head in the sand, landlords are not picking up the phone, tenants are not working together. It's a team effort, folks. Call your landlord, figure that figure it out, get the money, get it taken care of. 18 months is yours. And then you get to stay where you're at. This is amazing news for millions of struggling Americans that are facing eviction. And you all now have two months to get your living situation squared away thanks to these vital eviction moratorium stimulus funds. Of course, the, the court said this was illegal. So this is amazing. Biden just like, uh, yeah, Supreme Court, eh, I'm not listening to you. I'm just going to take care of it. And of course, Congress went on vacation. They didn't do anything. They're like, uh. so Biden had to step up to the plate, like him, don't like him, love him, hate him, doesn't matter. The next two months, you have some relief. That's your stimulus check, second stimulus check, eviction information. Uh, executive order, executive action and stimulus package update for Wednesday, August 4th, 2021. Thank you so much for watching it, you know, for making it to the end all the way here. Please leave a comment with your favorite artist, living or deceased. I'm Andrew Cartwright. Please take care of yourself. Stay safe. I love you. <sighs> oh, three months training every day anywhere from an hour to three hours a day every day just to miss a race how are you feeling very tired exhausted we're done right <laughs> <That's it. laughs>